In this video, we'll be taking a look at the hype around the Brave browser and how it compares to Google Chrome. The first thing we need to look at is page speed. Everyone's saying that Brave is faster than Chrome, but Brave is built on top of Chrome, so how can it be faster? Well, Brave does this by blocking ads and tracking software, which actually takes a long time to load. Now, when you're using the Brave browser, this is actually noticeable. It feels like a more premium, slicker experience. It also blocks things like pre-roll YouTube ads, which gives you more time to subscribe to channels that provide great content. The privacy protection is better as well. Google Chrome is owned by Google, obviously, and they also own Google Analytics, Google Ads. What most people don't know is that Google Ads is the biggest reseller of retargeting ads in the world. Retargeting ads is when you go on a website and then a week later you see an ads for that website pop up all over the web. For most consumers, the thought of their browsing data being sold by these giant corporations to the highest bidder doesn't appeal. Then there's a reward system. So the Brave browser was brought out of a blockchain project called the Basic Attention Token, or the BAT token, which was maybe created about 2017. And as a Brave user, you can earn cryptocurrency tokens for browsing the web and viewing ads if you turn on the ad viewing. This is disabled by default because all ads are disabled by default. But if you turn it on, then as a user, you can get paid to view ads. However, nothing's perfect and there are some downsides to using Brave. For me as a developer, I find that most of the third party tools that I use are designed for Chrome and I still use Chrome a lot for debugging. There was also an issue with extensions and add-ons, but now all the Chrome add-ons are also available in Brave. So if you think this is something that might appeal to you, then give Brave a go. There's a link in the description to a blog post on my website which gives tips and instructions on how to install it. Thank you for watching.